UFO enthusiasts are losing their minds over this recent footage of a SpaceX rocket going boom. What we are about to show you is going to rock you to your very foundation. This footage that you are watching now has been slowed down to 12,000 frames per second. You'll notice the quality of the replay is far better, far smoother than anything you've seen up until now. And it's at this speed that we're going to blow your mind. We're just going to let this play out so that you can see the dynamics of the explosion for yourselves. And while this is quite remarkable, it isn't the shock and awe that we're about to show you. Fasten your seatbelts, Dorothy. Here's the replay of the first few seconds of the explosion. Did you see it? Let's zoom in and try again. Even at this speed, it's difficult to see what triggers the explosion. Let's slow it down even more, and we'll focus on just a couple of frames. Do you see anything strange? The entire structure bends and vanishes into another dimension. Write your congressman today. What you're seeing here is like straight out of an episode of Fringe. And it's not until you slow this down to this speed and hit pause can you possibly see the incident clearly as it defies the laws of physics. And it gets even worse in the negative spectrum. Are you ready? Check this out. What is that? We're not sure what kind of payload was in this rocket, but clearly this was no communications satellite. Clearly this was no communications satellite. Either that or the weapon that hit this rocket is not of this world. In any case, you can clearly see that whatever happened here is bigger than they're letting on. If you're listening to this, you are the resistance. Clearly this was no communications satellite. Either that or the weapon that hit this rocket is not of this world. In any case, you can clearly see that whatever happened here is bigger than they're letting on. If you're listening to this, you are the resistance. another big story a major setback for spacex after its rocket exploded on the launch pad thursday morning this is the commercial space company that nasa has turned to for cargo and future manned missions but this particular rocket was on a facebook mission nbc's tom costello covers all things space for us tom good morning Good morning, Savannah. This is a significant setback, not just for SpaceX, but for Facebook. This was going to be a, a satellite inside this unmanned Falcon 9 rocket that would beam Internet access to Africa. Now, both companies are looking for answers and trying to regroup. A jaw-dropping sight, a SpaceX rocket exploding on the launch pad Thursday. The massive fireball swallowing it whole in a matter of seconds. A series of explosions and massive plumes of thick, billowing smoke. Oh, my God. The blast could be heard and felt for miles, even caught on weather radar. Urgency on police dispatch radio. There's a rocket segment that blew up. There's a pretty noxious smoke plume that's heading out towards the beach. Temporarily closing down the beach. Amazingly, no one was injured during this routine test gone bad, but the unmanned rocket was destroyed along with a special satellite. Its mission to help Facebook bring the Internet to parts of Africa. CEO Mark Zuckerberg saying he is deeply disappointed, but will keep working until everyone has the opportunities this satellite would have provided. The actual launch was scheduled for Saturday morning. SpaceX CEO billionaire Elon Musk says the cause still unknown. Wow as SpaceX investigates what went wrong. 
Yeah, the blast caused major damage, major damage to the SpaceX launch pad at Cape Canaveral. That could seriously impact the company's upcoming satellite launch schedule. But this is also a concern because this is the same type of rocket that will be used on future manned missions. So finding out what went wrong will be a very high priority. Guys, back to you. Yeah, I better believe it. Tom Costello, thank you.